Unified School is being let out. Buses arriving on Worth Avenue. Minor accident on Highway. Traffic near Dixon 5 has been cleared. I see you're on 6th Street, is that right? We have police on the way. Rich 10 911. Where's your emergency? Pull up camera 5. We have an explosion sensor alert on Folsom Street. Notify the 911 center. We got it. Affirmative on the explosion. We need camera parameters set up monitoring in that location and between 13th and 14th Street. The 911 center has been notified. 911, where's your emergency? Yes, we've identified that we have an explosion. Can you tell me exactly what you see? Just send help now! All overflow calls are being routed to the Jackson PSAP Center. Yes, we have reports of an explosion. Help is on the way. I have you located at 36 Balsam Street. Please confirm. It was an explosion. A man ran out, jumped in a white van, and sped away. Are you injured? Dispatch to car 3, 4, 5, and 6. Radio all units. Dispatch Fire Battalion 4, Engine Company 4, and Ladder 6. Be advised, we have an explosion and building collapse. All cars, please respond to 28 Fulton Street. This is car 4. I'm en route to 13th Street. Upload any photos you have. We've uploaded to your monitor. I'm pulling up on 13th and Folsom. Explosion, unknown cause, and a partially collapsed two-story commercial structure. Possible workers trapped. Dispatch a second alarm and stage those westbound on Washington at corner of 14th Street. Also, include rescue hazmat on that second alarm, but have them stage at the corner of Folsom and 14th Street. Police are on scene reporting explosion and partial building collapse. Battalion 4 has requested second alarm. First alarm units are to continue into Folsom via 13th and 14th Street. Battalion 4 is incident command. Advise Rescue Hazmat that upon arrival, we need air monitoring and assistance with primary search. Request Building Department for Structural Stability Assessment and the Utility Company to disconnect gas and electric. Advise EMS to expect patients, unknown numbers and conditions at this time. Notify investigators. I have a witness giving details on a white van that fled the scene. I have investigators en route to the scene at Fusion Center for follow-up. We will designate Channel 15 Investigative Communications. We need eyes in the sky. Get the drone up. Bridgeton Police Drone in air. Drone channel is 5. I've got visual on screen. Rear of structure is potentially unstable. We have advised members operating on the interior to use caution in that area. Utility company on scene. Gas and electric disconnection underway. Get the drone closer to the tracks for tighter visual. Heavy debris is covering the tracks adjacent to the building. Alert Metro Railroad Control with an urgent message to stop all rail traffic in both directions. And notify Marine 2 to assess the river. We have camera sightings of the white van. Plain readers are showing itself in Montague within east of Van Buren. White van is currently traveling south on Amsterdam Avenue. Car 4, we track suspicious van. It's registered to Florence's Flower Shop. This van, be advised. I interviewed an employee, check token. We have located a victim under debris. We're bringing him out. EMS, male victim with leg injuries plus contusions to upper extremities. Prep for arrival in two minutes. Bridgeton Hospital, this is Unit 712. Activate a trauma alert. We have a 39-year-old male with crushing injuries from a partial building collapse. Injuries to torso, apparent broken ribs, and trauma to his legs. Sharing vitals now via telemed. Victim is stable, conscious, and communicating at this time. We will have a trauma team available on arrival. Seeing vitals now. We initiated bilateral IVs and patient is receiving 100% oxygen on a non rebreather I'd like to share information we have regarding today's building explosion at the furniture factory at 28 Folsom Street. At approximately 4.08 p.m., a detention sensor alerted public safety officials to an explosion. It was quickly determined the blast originated at 28 Folsom, a business known as Kramer's Furniture Factory. Fire is out and the building has been ventilated. Primary and secondary searches are complete, all workers accounted for. Second alarm companies are being released. First alarm companies are currently being rehabbed and will remain on scene to assist in salvage of building contents.
the cause of the explosion has been determined to be an accidental release of natural gas. Investigators are on the scene and we expect that they will issue a formal report with more specific information as to the cause later in the week. There are absolutely no indication at this time that this was an intentional act. We would like to thank the swift action of our dedicated first responders and public safety professionals, as well as the advanced technology that accelerate our response and enhanced agency communications. The city of Bridgeton is a smarter, safer place because of their fine work.